Welcome to another Tableau tutorial video. Today I'm going to show you how to filter out null values when you've got a data set such as this. This is universities that have provided average GMAT scores, average class size, and maximum class size. Now what I want to do is I want to be able to filter out, in this case, I want to just look for programs that have a GMAT score greater than 561. Well, there's still a lot of programs in here that have null values, and I don't want to show those. So the key here is you come under Edit in Shelf, and we're going to select Home, go to the front. We're going to type in ZN for zero. It's a function that says if there's a null value, put in a zero. Put a parentheses around the whole function, press Enter, and now you have zeros. Now you may be asking yourself, hey, why is this still not going to zero? And if I filter, it's having problems. Okay, to get around this, it's for whatever reason, it's still registering the last, the original values. So I've removed that filter, come in here, show filter. Now this will show a zero, and then you can adjust it and all the zeros for the nulls are gone. We'll do the same thing, we'll do it two more times just so you see. Average class size, select it, edit in shelf. I press home, you could also do arrows, ZN, parentheses, go to the end, parentheses, enter. And now watch when I go show filter, it'll show up here, and now it's already got the zero, so I can already go First, I want to see things that are um, average class size that's greater than 141. Well, that's not quite what we were thinking, was it? Because there's still a lot in here. Oh, because I've changed the average GMAT score. That's a problem when you add the new um, average. Let's change the title. We'll just call this class size. Is changing the wrong value. All right, so now when I go, you'll see, scroll through here, nothing less than 25. So come under max class size, do the same thing, edit in shelf. Now I'm going to press arrow just to show you, press the left, ZN, and change that to a, you're putting the whole aggregate function inside it, end, close paren, and now when you hit show filter. This is, um, let me change this, edit this so we can see what it says. And now you can edit out the value.